Welcome to my channel. This video shows the design and analysis of a single stage operational amplifier using cadence virtuoso. Op amp is used as a critical block in A2D converters, comparators, and many more applications. For the design of a single stage operational amplifier, Get the instances of PMOS and NMOS transistors from GPDK 90 nanometer into the design canvas. For that, go to the instance, select the GPDK 90 from the cell, select the PMOS, place the PMOS. Click on sideways to rotate. Now you select the NMOS. Then click on sideways. to place the transistors based on their orientation. Click on again sideways. Finally, one more transistor. So total six transistors are placed. Two are PMOS which acts as a current mirror. These two act as a differential amplifier. And again, these two transistors will act as a current mirror. Now make the required connections by using the wire. Since this is a current mirror, P type. Now it forms a diode connected. Now these two transistors will act as a differential pair and this is a current mirror made up of NMOS transistors. Connect the sources towards the ground. Since this is grounded, let me connect this here because this is a substrate which is connected to the lower potential. Provide the biasing to these transistors. Go to the instance. This time, select the analog library. From that, select VDC, and DC current, IDC, similarly, sinusoidal input for differential pair. Let me move this a bit side.
provide the capacitor at the output finally ground finalize the connections this one act as the output provide the pin name to v out connect this now the op amp is driving a load of 1 pico farad the capacitance placed is 1 pico farad since this is acting these two transistors are acting as a differential amplifier let me name this vn and vp for inverting and for non inverting so design is completed now let me provide the parameters to this sources provide a DC voltage of 1.8 volt the op amp is biased by using a DC current of 164 micro amps so whatever the current that is there it should exist along this current mirror and for this positive side provide a AC magnitude of 1 millivolt and offset of 0 0.9 or 900 millivolt which is half of the supply voltage here VDC is 1.8 volt. Now it changes to 900 millivolt. Similarly, for this source, press Q and change the offset voltage to 0 0.9 millivolt, which is 900 millivolts. Click on OK. This is having a AC magnitude of 1 millivolt. Here we are not providing a magnitude of 1 millivolt to show the phase shift. Now let me try to change the length and width of the PMOS and NMOS transistors. Select these two PMOS transistors, press Q and let me Define the length to be 400 nanometer and total width is 2 micrometers. Select, you can apply to the selected, all selected. Now the width is 2 micrometer, here also it is a 2 micrometer since this is a current mirror. Both should have the equal currents that's why we have equal width and equal length similarly for nmos transistors all the four transistors the length is 400 nanometer and the width is 2 micrometer you can select one by one or all at a time Observe the these two transistors are having equal widths and these two transistors also are having equal width. This op amp is driving a load of one peak. Now design is completed.
click on check and save go to the launch click on adel right click to add the analysis or you can click here perform the ac analysis starting from 1 hertz to 10 megahertz click on okay just click on netlist and run simulation is completed go to the results click on direct plot select ac gain and phase then select the output followed by the input vp this too shows the magnitude and phase plot of the op amp click on this observe that the op amp provide a gain of 26.55 db up to a frequency of 10 power 6 and it has a phase shift of phase margin is 179.99 degrees so which is very less but it is a single stage operational amplifier further it can be enhanced by providing a common source amplifier either you can plot in another way or let me plot this let me click on this right click click on edit open the calculator then select the vf that means frequency domain vf select the v out then again vf this time select the vp then click on the divide symbol v out by v in will provide you the gain but i want to express it in db which is 20 log click on all select the db 20 you can click here on the gear symbol to send it to the buffer expression you can observe that in the adl window it is loaded here similarly you can even calculate the bandwidth in the similar manner open the calculator click on vf select the v out from the function panel select the bandwidth place the output signal click on okay you can evaluate or send it to the buffer the two expressions are loaded into the adel window here you will have the bandwidth of this op amp single stage op amp let me close this this plot as well now click on this netlist and run see that the gain is around 26.5 
db only gain is plotted only gain plot in a similar manner you can find that the bandwidth provided by this single stage op amp is 2.8857 megahertz